All right, let's get this holiday train rolling. Hey everyone, welcome to my channel. If you are new here, I'm Christopher, and I'm so excited to have you with us today. If you like lifestyle, luxury, planning, and organization, basically if you like anything, this channel is for you. So go ahead and click that little red subscribe button, and while you're at it, you might as well hop on over to Instagram and follow me over there as well. I'll leave my handle right here on the screen. I post over there daily, and it's a great way for us to connect and get to know each other a little bit better. Today, I am so excited. I'm looking around because there's so many good things because I am bringing you my 2017 holiday gift guide. I'm covering everything from skincare, tech, music, luxury, fragrances, home. I have something for everyone. And I'm also being really cognizant to have things in a variety of price points. And don't you worry, I will leave everything linked down below as I do in all of my videos so you can access it easily. As I look around, I'm surrounded by so many of the things that I've loved this year. They cover every genre from tech to fashion to accessories to fragrances to home to books to music. Literally, it's so many of my favorite things. I feel like I'm having my Oprah moment and I get to share them all with you. So let's go ahead and jump in. So the first thing I'm going to share is some skincare because I feel like skincare is a really great gift to give. And two of my favorite things are the Origins Ginseng line. They have a awesome refreshing scrub, which is a really light exfoliant, so you can use it frequently. Has this beautiful scent that kind of feels like the holidays and a little special. And I just really love this cleanser. It leaves your skin automatically looking more radiant, really smooth, and it really prepares your skin for whatever products you're going to put on later. And one of those should often be the Ginseng Pill Off Mask. I love this mask so much. A, it feels really luxurious because it is like a very like rose gold um, mask and it like is metallic looking. It's very iridescent. It feels really special and luxurious, but it also is really great to refine and refresh your skin. These are two skincare products that I love to give as gifts. The next two skincare products will come as no surprise. I can't tell you how many times I bought them and talked about them on my channel, but they are two masks from Herbivore. The reason I think masks are such a great gift, it's something sometimes people forget to buy for themselves, so you're kind of giving them a little self-care. The reason I choose these two, because it can go with any skin type. So the first one is the Herbivore Brightening Mask. This is a pineapple enzyme mask. It gives instant glow to the skin. You literally see results but it smells really great. It's really simple to use, but like I said, goes with all skin types, which I think is incredibly helpful when you're gifting someone skincare. The other one that I really love is the Herbivore Pink Clay Mask. Now this one does come in a powder form, so you mix it equal parts water to get a nice mask consistency, but this one is an awesome pink clay mask and it has flower petals ground down into it, and it's a, just a really gentle exfoliating mask, so once again, can be used on every skin type, and because it is so gentle, even if the person you gift it to has sensitive skin, they will be able to use this. But masks are a great, great gift, and the Herbivore line is just fantastic. The next thing we're gonna talk about are fragrances. Now, fragrances are incredibly personal because you're picking out something that someone's going to wear, and people definitely have specific tastes when it comes to fragrances. And let's face it, they're expensive. They range anywhere from 50 to 100 over, well over $100. So one of my recommendations would be to pick up travel sizes that are much smaller. These typically range in cost from 15 to around $27, so you can get them multiples for the same price as one bottle, giving them a sampling to see what they like and what they don't like. Um, but I am going to share with you some of my favorite fragrances. The first is Elizabeth and James Nirvana Bourbon. Um, this has like a tobacco, vanilla bourbon scent. The best way I can explain it is you're a little bit drunk and you're baking a cake. It reminds me a lot of Tom Ford's Tobacco Vanille, which is incredibly expensive, but I do love it. But this is just a really, really great fragrance and I find that most people like this. So that is one that I always recommend. The next one, which will come as no surprise, but I love it so much, is Book by Commodity. Yeah, I don't know how to explain it. It's something so earthy and warm about it. 
um, that I think it's pretty neutral for all people. The next one, I'm not going to lie, is an expensive travel perfume, but it is my holiday go-to, and that is Hermes Amber Narguil. It has a very warm amber smell, clearly from the name, but it also smells a lot like a rum cake. I don't know if any of you have ever had rum cake. My grandmother used to make them, but it add amber and a rum cake, and that's pretty much how it smells. I really, really love it. My 2017 favorite fragrance is probably Mason Louise Marie Number no. 4 de Bellencourt. It is sandalwood, cedarwood with some cinnamon and nutmeg. It's really earthy. It also comes in an oil, which lasts all day long. I get so many compliments on it. I really, really love this. For people who love an earthy fragrance, this is a great way to go, and I've been using it religiously, and because it's an oil, it just lasts so long, but great gift this year for people who love earthy fragrances. It is going to be my go-to. Now we're going to get into the really fun stuff. So these are truly gifts that I've been given that I am in love with, and one of my favorite things I've been given is this awesome bath tray. Um, Steven gave this to me a while ago. What I love about this tray is there is a place for your wine glass a place for a candle, and then this flips up to rest your book in, and these wood slats extend really far. It can go up to like 35 inches wide, which is an enormous tub. Um, I love it. I also recommend the wood ones versus like the wire ones because this doesn't bow when it's fully extended. I find that the wire ones the longer you make it, the more it dips in the middle. With the wood, it doesn't do that. Um, and you don't have to worry about rust, but this is an awesome, awesome self-care gift to give to someone, or yourself for that matter. Um, I just really love it. It makes bath time feel so luxurious and super, super special. Um, yeah, it's just really, really wonderful. Anyone who loves a good bath, this is a great gift to give. While we're talking about self-care in that bath tray, I said there's a perfect spot for a candle, and I think candles get very, very expensive. I have paid 60 upwards to $100 for one single candle, but I'm telling you, for the amount of money, the White Barn candles from Bath & Body Works, specifically this one in Evergreen, I think they are very reasonably priced for the quality, so these are on sale currently for $12.50. Um, they also up their game, so have like this beautiful marble lid, which I do appreciate the simplicity and the fact that there's not like a big like Christmas tree on it. Um, they're very discreet, very beautiful, and just very clean and simple. It's a three wick candle. The evergreen throws a lot of fragrance. I'm really, really pleased with their white barn candles. So I think this is a really great gift. This with the bath tray and a good book makes an awesome, awesome present. Since I just mentioned books, let me talk about some of my favorites. I have three books. Two are kind of like year-long books that you pick up and read, and then one is a piece of fiction that I think is super important that everyone reads. The first one is The Wisdom of Sundays by Oprah Winfrey. I love Super Soul Sunday. It's on the OWN network. I watch it frequently, and what Oprah has done is curated the years of discussions through Super Soul Sunday and took out her favorite excerpts. It's also just beautifully photographed. The photographs actually are from Oprah's property. Um, it's just a stunning book and it touches on things like awakening, intention, mindfulness, spirituality, ego, forgiveness, grace and gratitude, fulfillment, love and connection. It's a beautiful book. It's one that you can just open and glean something from it every single time. I think it's a great book to give to people this year. A, another favorite, favorite book is The Year of Cozy by Adriana Adarm. I probably said that wrong and I apologize, but this is 125 recipes, crafts, and other homemade adventures. It is a beautifully photographed book and it gives you everything from doggy treats to homemade candles to chorizo spiced squash soup. For anyone who is a lifestyle buff and loves to home make, this is an awesome, awesome book. It's one that I flip through all the time. I actually display it out on my kitchen counter because I love it so much and it's just so beautiful. Great book to give anyone. And lastly, a piece of fiction that I would encourage everyone to give as a gift, whether it is to a teenager or to an adult, is The Hate You Give by Angie Thomas. This book touches on racism, it touches on equality, it touches on being a good human. 
Um, I think this is a piece of fiction that everyone should read if you haven't read it already. It is a great, great book. Um, I've talked about it in detail in I think last month's or the month before. I think September's favorite things. Um, yeah, this book is just incredible. Give it to every teenager, every college student, every adult you know. Um, it's super powerful and I think a book that everyone should be reading in 2018. Next I'm going to talk about some tech and the first one I'm going to talk about is the Brewberry Electric Wine Opener. If you are a wine person or know a wine person, this is an awesome gift to give. It comes with its own little charging pad so you literally just set this down when you're done and it charges through these little metal feet on the bottom and it's simple. You just screw it down, screw it up and it opens up your wine every single time. This is only like $20 on Amazon. Steven and I have been using it religiously for over a year. We have never had a problem with it. It never makes a mistake with your wine bottle. It is just a terrific, terrific gift to give. Um, I absolutely love it and I'm so excited to share it with you. The next gift I want to talk about is from 12 South. They have really great phone, iPad, and Apple Watch holders, but this one has been a game changer. Steven gifted this to me last year um, for Christmas and because I travel a lot for work and just travel a lot in general, this watch holder has helped me keep my Apple Watch all together. It's also super compact. So what happens is, is the dock for your Apple Watch actually slides into this top portion of the case. So you just sit this on your nightstand, which I do leave mine out on my nightstand. So when I am traveling, I can just grab it all and it's always in the same place. And you just lay your watch across it. You also, when you're traveling, can wind up your cord, put your extra watch bands in this little section here, and it's just really, really fabulous. This has become one of my favorite things. When I'm ready to travel, I just yank it out of the outlet, I throw in an extra band if I need it, I close it up, and I know I have everything I need for my Apple Watch. 12 South makes really great holders for iPads, iPhones, and Apple Watches. Definitely check them out this holiday season. Everything comes in two color waves, black and white. Um, so really classic and yeah, everyone will love this, everyone. My next two tech favorites are not to be given together, um, but more or less to show you two options. I think an awesome gift for anybody, teenager, adult, like a fitness guru, a traveler, anyone would love a set of wireless headphones. I could tell you right now, I've used so many wireless headphones in so many different price ranges from Bose to Jawbone or Jaybirds, but I consistently come back to Beats. The ones that I particularly love are the Power Beats 2. These are wireless headphones. What I love about them is A, they come in multiple sizes of earpieces that you could put in, but I love that they have the wraparound earpiece that really holds the headphone in. They connect wonderfully and simply with your iPhone. You can control your volume and you have a built-in microphone. I love these things beyond belief. They have lasted me so, so long, so many runs. I think this is a great one for anyone who's incredibly active. Now for the traveler, I would recommend a set of the wireless head over ear headphones. These are called the Solos by Beats. They are super comfortable. They cancel out a lot of noise. You can adjust your volume all on this little push pad right here. I think these are great. They come in a travel case. These are the ones I use if I'm on the couch editing while Steven is in the living room or I'm traveling on a plane. They're just comfortable. You can wear them all day long. Um, but a set of wireless headphones for anyone is such a great, great gift and they will love them and it's something they will use all the time. While we're talking about speakers, I have shared this upcoming speaker in a favorites video as well and that is the UE Roll waterproof speaker. Steven and I use this in our bathroom every single day. It is the best bathroom waterproof speaker I have found. In fact, it's one of the best Bluetooth speakers I've ever found in general. Um, I just simply love it. I'll be honest with you, I do not love the color waves that it comes in, but I can overlook it just because of the sheer amazingness of the quality of sound that comes from it. It has a little loop. We just hang it on a command hook in our bathroom, but you could also take this elastic hook, wrap it around something if you need to, and then link it. It is a great speaker at a great price point. 
and I think so many people would love it. The next gift is tech and a little bit of music, but one thing that Steven got me that I absolutely love is this Crossley record player. Now, this one is not super fancy. It's not the best of quality, but it gets the job done, and it's loud enough for me and what I use it for but I really, really love it. It is super easy to use. It's a great, great record player, but it also has an auxiliary if you wanted to plug in bigger speakers or headphones. And you can pair this gift with vintage records that might hold some specific memories. So for me, the Barbra Streisand Christmas album, along, along with this Dolly, Dolly, Dolly record, um, are two that my grandmother had that I listened to all the time with her. Just seeing the cover of this one, brings back so many memories. So to play this record again is really cool. And to find those vintage records that mean something to people and pair it with the record player, what a personal but yet really cool gift to give. And what's more exciting is so many artists now are releasing their albums on vinyl. So Adele's 25, which is phenomenal. I have Lady Gaga's Joanne. I have Adele 21. I have Sarah Bareilles. Listening to them on vinyl just gives it a really cool, different vibe um, and a different listening experience. And I'll often play these when I'm cleaning or just hanging around the house. I really, really think it's a cool gift to give. So yes, definitely, definitely check it out. While we are talking about music, I found the best album I've probably bought in 2017, even though it was just recently released in October. I have it in a CD. I have it in an album, and I also bought it on iTunes because it is so good, and that is The Meaning of Life by Kelly Clarkson. I am a Kelly Clarkson fan, but this is by far the best album, A, she's ever produced, but one of the rare albums where I can listen and enjoy every single song, all 14 of them, are absolutely amazing. I think this is a great gift. What I think it will translate with a lot of people is it's definitely like a contemporary pop album, but it has a lot of influences from people that I grew up loving. Mariah Carey, Whitney Houston, In Vogue. It's just really well done. Um, I just really love it. She really did an outstanding job. And actually, this is the first album that she was able to release outside of her contract from American Idol. So 15 years later, she got to make the album that she wanted to make and it's really wonderful. I recommend it, I enjoy it. Next is a set of pajamas that I recently got and I'm obsessed with, and it is this onesie from Burt's Bees. They are organic cotton, they come for the entire family, they button down the front, and they're just so festive and striped. They are so ridiculously soft. I didn't know Burt's Bees started making pajamas. They also have this um, rugby stripe as well as, is it a plaid? Something in the blue or green family color wave. I don't, I'm not quite sure, but they are great pajamas to give for Christmas. These would be great to give Christmas Eve so everyone could sleep in them that night. Really, really fabulous product. Um, I'm tall and they work for me. Um, I love them. I love them so stinking much. Great gift. And then I picked this up yesterday. It is a scarf. It is from Free People. It is enormous. It is zhuzhy. It is so soft. And what I love the most is it doesn't leave fuzz all over your clothes and yet is still so soft and luxurious. Um, it is a great scarf. It comes in so many different colors, but I bought it yesterday and I already said like it has to go in the gift guide because it is so, so good. It's a great, great scarf and I think it's a great gift to give during the holiday season. Now these are some luxury goods that I think make really great gifts and I don't think you have to go all out, but I think that these are really great options. I think an awesome gift to give people this year are six key card holders. It is a piece of luxury that you get to touch every single day, so it feels really luxurious and special, but they're also so functional. I have the six key holder from Louis Vuitton as well as Prada, and I love these things because if you don't wanna take your wallet, you can throw a debit card in here or a credit card and take everything you need for the day with you in this one little compact case. They are super high quality. They are at a good price point to get someone's luxury collection started. Um, they also feel really special for a good price point. I think these are great gifts to give to a loved one. They're not cheap, but it's, it's, 
it's a reasonable piece of luxury that I think people will really enjoy. If you don't want to spend that much on a key holder, I have found a key holder from West Elm that is handmade that I absolutely love. And it is this little gold minimalistic white enameled keychain. It's on springs here. It's really well made. And you put your keys on it. I love the minimalist design of it. I think it's really, really special. I think it's really different and cool. And I think a lot of people would love these. And it's $15. Um, it's a really great gift. It comes in a really cute box. It's all set to go and gift give. The next gift I'm going to share is uberly expensive. Um, but I think it is so incredibly special. And that is this advent calendar from Diptyque. It is a 24 day advent calendar. It comes with fragrances. The lighting is getting weird, gang, and I'm so sorry. It comes with fragrances, candles. It does retail for about $400. Steven surprised me with this one for this year. I cannot wait to open it during Vlogmas. I am so excited about it. And yeah, it's really awesome. I'm going to apologize now for that shift in lighting. I'm dealing with some natural lighting from the windows and it's a cloudy day, so it's a little uneven. So I apologize for that. I've readjusted it, um, but I wasn't looking into the viewfinder, so I missed it. So apologize, but we're gonna keep on rolling because I only have a couple things left to share. So I shared that really expensive Diptyque advent calendar, but I think advent calendars are great gifts and you can actually get them at very fair prices as well. So I wanna share some that are a lot more reasonable, but I still think they feel just as special. One is the David's Tea advent calendar for any tea lover. This is a great advent calendar to give. It comes with this awesome magnetic case and then you can pull out each day and in it is an individual little tea cup. You can get about two cups of tea out of each and then engraved on the back is the name of the tea. So this one is Carrot Cupcake. Um, just an awesome, awesome gift for any tea lover. If you gave them this with a beautiful tea cup, that would be such an awesome, awesome gift. A another reasonably priced advent calendar for what you are getting is the Lush 12 Days of Christmas advent calendar. And it are 12 compartments. They are full size products. So like they're not little samples. They come in like very nice large um, containers. And I think it is an awesome, awesome gift to give. So yes, the 12 Days of Christmas advent calendar from Lush is definitely a go-to. The next advent calendar that I'm giving my nieces is this 24 day advent calendar from Sephora. That is why it isn't opened, but it has everything from headbands to makeup to skincare um, to different accessories with bath products. It is really a great advent calendar for everyone um, and it's really reasonably priced. So all of this is around $45 and it's an advent calendar that they will enjoy and have a variety of things to give a try. Great, great gift idea. I would suggest just look at your favorite brand. So many of them have advent calendars and an advent calendar is a gift you can give in during Thanksgiving to a family member. Be like, this is your Christmas gift and you have, they have something to open every single day. That's what I'm doing with my nieces. I'm wrapping their advent calendar and giving them to them over Thanksgiving. So that is my collection of favorite gifts to give for this holiday season. Like I said, I did a lot of products so that there was something here for everyone. I I hope that you really, really enjoyed it. If you have any questions, just ask. I'll leave everything linked down below. I'm wishing you all a safe and wonderful holiday. Please make sure you are subscribed because I have some holiday prep videos coming up as well. I will leave this video like I leave all of them. Take care of yourself, take care of others, and be kind. Kindness is free. Give it to everyone. Until next time, bye-bye. Up next to you, we'll be sharing a secret.